Courtney, those shoes do not match. I don't know what you were thinking. Really? You think so? Yeah, Courtney, what were you thinking? I would have put some, like, a different pair of shoes on. Like, you should have put on pastel pink shoes, not, like, hot pink. It just doesn't go. Well, I was sort of in a You were studying. This oh, really? Well, you no, you were not beforehand. studying. Don't lie to me. Really? Yes, I was yeah, studying. No, you were not. You yes, doing yes no, I was um, Well, you should still have time to pick on your app sure. today. Like, plan it ahead of time. Too. Like, maybe you could plan it next week or something like that. But don't you have to study well, for that? I you're failing that. So I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, really? You're studying, huh? Hey, Brianna. Do you want to come over to my house? You mean right now? Yeah, we were going to head over to my place after Lana got out of cheerleading practice. Oh, yeah, sure. I mean, as long as it's fine with you guys. Yeah, you can come along, Brianna. Oh, hey, Brianna. So is she coming with us? Yeah, she's coming. So, Brianna, do you like my room? Yeah, it's just, it's like so big. I mean, you even have your own couch. Anyway, Brianna, we wanted to ask you something. Yeah, and what's that? Well, I don't really want to sound mean, but do you mind if we give you a makeover? Like, just do your hair and your makeup for fun. I mean, yeah, sure, if you want to. out and like comb it or maybe we could do this with the oh yeah her makeup i was thinking like we keep it the same but like a little different you know so what do you think oh wow it's, it's really nice what you did you know you should totally wear that dress tomorrow you can keep it i mean don't you think it's a bit short trust me it's perfect it looks so good on you well thanks for this makeover you know you should always do your hair like this every day like you know how i do my hair like i'll tell you how to do it so I see you wore the dress. Yeah, I really like your outfit. Where do you get your clothes from? Well, I get them at this online store and this other store at the mall. Maybe I'll take you shopping with me one day. Oh, okay. Hey, maybe we should head over to English now. Oh yeah, you're right. Come on, let's go. So, like, you know, me and Courtney have been so busy lately. Well, why have you two been so busy? Well, it's a secret, so don't tell anyone. So, we've all been planning to host this big party at uh, Rosemary's house, you know? It's gonna be this huge, big thing. I mean, you know, we're not supposed to tell anyone about it, but you seem real cool, so... I really want Rose to invite you, but... I mean, she doesn't really know you, so... Oh, I get it. But maybe if you could help us with this other thing, then maybe she'll consider inviting you. And what is this? You see, Rose used to have this key, and she brought it to school, and they confiscated it. And they never gave it back to her, and it's been about a year, and she wants to get it back. And what about it? Well, we were thinking about sneaking into the school and, you know, stealing it. I mean, it's not really stealing because... It's Rose's, and they took it from her. And you want me to help you with that so I can get invited to her party. You know, I think you're trying to make me steal something for you and take the blame for it. Look, I didn't say you had to do it. You don't have to at all. And besides, it wouldn't be you only breaking into the school. We all would be doing it. And trust me, you could probably find another way to get invited to Rose's party. Her party's going to be in like three weeks from now, so you have a lot of time. I promise, I promise, I'll bring my uniform next time. Keep running, come on! <laughs> hey, how did you get out of PE? You know how today it was really sunny? Well, you see, I have a skin condition, so I really can't stay out in the heat, so that's how I was able to get out of PE today. You know, if you really want to get invited to Rose's party, then you're going to need experience. So, why don't you and me go to a party tonight? Really? You want to go to a party with me? 
Yeah, I'll take you. There's one tonight. We could go. Oh, wow. Thanks, Evie. Anyway, are you gonna get anything from this stupid lunch line? Come on, let's go. Hey, Rihanna. Rihanna. Yeah, what is it? It's almost midnight. We gotta get home. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. My curfew. Oh, my God. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm going to go. The way you were just like over there, and you told me you didn't want to go. Well, I didn't say I didn't want to go. I I was fine with it. <laughs> well, I had a good time. Yeah, but maybe you have another chance of getting invited to Rose's party. <laughs> anyway, so how do you think we're gonna get home now, Evie? What are you doing? Oh my God, Brianna, Evie, what are you doing? What's wrong, Evie? Brianna, we need to get out of here quick. Well, why? There's a dead body. Well, why don't we call the cops? No, 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 it's too late. They're gonna... Just, let's go, come on. No, we should... We should... Don't, come on. Brianna, let's leave. Okay. Timothy Grayson. Who? What? Who? Who? He was a 10th grader that went to our school, and he went missing, like, three weeks ago, and they found his body in an alleyway. When did they find his body? They found his body last yesterday. But last week, when me and Brianna went to a party, we were walking home, and we came across a dead body in the alleyway. I think it was him. Wait a minute, you came across a dead body? Why didn't you call the cops? Well, it was late, and I was scared, and we needed to get home. We couldn't deal with that crap. Well, how did he die? Did it say it in the article? Yeah, that's what I was getting onto. They said when they found his body, it was a skeleton. Like, he was thin. His face and everything, like it looked like he had no meat or fat on his body, like it looked like something suctioned it out, out of it. Did it look like that? It looked exactly like that. Like, his body, you could see his bones sticking out of his face, his cheekbones and everything. It, it was, he looked like a skeleton. This is why we gotta keep the party under wraps, because if people figure out that we're hosting the party, they're gonna try to shut it down. Why? I don't get how a teen going missing has to do with your party. Well, for a fact, he's not the only one that went missing. Teens have been going missing for months. And if people figure out that we're trying to have some big gathering with a ton of teenagers, they're not gonna try to shut it down because they'll think that more teens will get kidnapped that way. Yeah, that's what happened at Heather's party. They shut it down because they said it was too risky or whatever. But speaking of parties, Brianna, do you want to come over to my place to help me make party invitations for Rose's party? Oh yeah, um, sure, I guess. So, where's the paper, pens, and markers? Didn't you say you wanted to make party invitations? Oh yeah, but it's fine. I'm just going to print the party invitations on my computer. I just wanted to talk to you. But I just need you to help me make some special invitations for people that Rose really wants to invite. Like who? Like her very close friends or people that she used to go to school with, like at her old school. Like she used to go to like, um, boarding school, I think. Yeah, so those are the people that I'm making the invitations for. Oh, okay. But before we do that, can I ask you a question? Yeah, sure. What is it? What is this key that belongs to Rose that she doesn't have anymore that the school has. It isn't just um, any other key, it's a special one. It's an heirloom in her family. Wow, so it's like an heirloom in her family, so that's why it's so important to her? Well, here's the thing. Rose sort of lost the key or whatever. At school, basically, they confiscated it because she was, you know, um, she did something and they took it away from her and she needs to get it back because if her parents figure out that she lost it Then they're gonna be really mad at her. Well besides it being an heirloom Is there anything else special about this key? Well, it's also kind of like a necklace you could wear it around, you know, but it could unlock any door That's what's so special about it. The key is specially made. It can unlock any door Really? You're serious? It can unlock any door? That's sort of why Rose needs the key, but I really can't tell you about that. Oh, all right. Okay, girls, practice is over. Make sure to practice those exercises over the weekend. Oh, hey. Hey, Lana. Oh, hey, Brianna. So you said you wanted to meet me up right after you got out of cheerleading practice? Oh, yeah, but I gotta go change really quick, so um, I'll see you later. 
What are you wearing? I didn't have time to do laundry today, so I just decided to put on my old school uniform from when I used to go to boarding school. Really? You used to go to boarding school? Yeah, I used to go to boarding school up until I was around 14. Well, when I was younger, I always wanted to go to boarding school. Can you tell me what it's like? It's very different than what it's like in the movies, you know? At boarding schools, it's very strict and they're always on top of your case. I mean, sometimes it was fun. You always got to hang out with your friends all the time, but I never really saw my parents that often, you know? Well, why did you stop going to boarding school? You know, I just forgot. Rose told me that she wanted you to stop by her house. Oh, really? Why? I don't know, I just think she wanted to ask you about something. Maybe you should head over there after we go to the mall. Yeah, maybe I'll go do that afterwards. Come in! Hey, so Lana said that you wanted to talk to me. Why? Well, I'm pretty sure Lizzie already told you about the key that belongs to my family. Yeah, she told me all about it. Well, tonight we're going to break into the school and we're going to go get it. And I was wondering if you wanted to join us. I don't think so. Look, Rose, you're cool and everything, but I'm not willing to get caught stealing just to help you out. Well, if you don't want to do it, that's fine. But I have one more thing to ask you. What? I do get the key. Do you mind watching it for me while I go on vacation? You want me to watch over it for you while you're on vacation? Yeah, do you think you can do that for me? I mean, I guess so. Okay, I'll do it for you. If you ever change your mind, meet us up at the school at 7.30. See ya. So, is Brianna gonna come? I don't think so. I think it's safe now. I just do hear that. Shh, be quiet. Brianna, so you decided to come after all. Yeah, I guess I had changed my mind last minute. I think it's time we could go in. We're gonna get inside the building anyway. In the office, they have a spare extra key that could open any of the doors in the school, so I just took it. You mean you stole it? Well, I'm gonna put it back under the door when we leave. Okay, let's hurry up and just get inside and do this, all right? Come on, let's go. Nobody's here. Oh, what's that? So, explain to me why we're in the teacher's lounge. Because if this is where my teacher probably hid the key. Where is it? Hey, Rose, can you be a little bit quiet? <gasps> See, this is the key. Really? That's it? It looks more like a cross. Well, it's supposed to be disguised as one, so people won't know it's a key. Hey Rose, are you gonna pick up that mess and clean up a little bit? Uh, guys, Lana just texted me. She said we should probably get out the building. Here, Brianna, take it. What, you want me to watch over for you, like, right now? Yeah, just take it. My family's gonna leave the airport in a couple of hours, and I need to get there. Thanks, Brianna. I'll see you when I get back.
look, is that Rose? Oh my gosh, she's back from vacation. I think she's been back. Look, she's going to that girl. Rose is back. Look, there's Rose. So Rose wants to let me meet upstairs in 15 minutes. She also wants to know if you brought the keys. Oh yeah, of course I did. Okay, well, see you later. Thanks for watching over the key for me while I was gone, Brianna. You're welcome. Come inside, everyone. That's all that's in here? A bed? Hey, what are you doing? What are you guys doing? Why are you guys touching me? Let me go. What, what's going on? What are you guys doing? Let me go.